Hello people, how you doing, how you doing? Back again, oh, I like this lark. One video per month. <laughs> well, subject to the horror of having to watch the World Cup and England absolutely crap. Um, gladly, I'll get to do a YouTube video, my last one, in what is a terrible house full of bubble wrap, mess, emptiness and nothing else. Uh, as I'm about to get ready to move in uh, just over a week's time. But before that, I got a few little um, movies and stuff I want to quickly show you. This one arrived today. Weird. A courier arriving on a Sunday. Mm. And this is Braveheart, or a.k.a. Freedom! Yes, the men with long hair, half blue faces. And uh, this was a time of epics, uh, of extras, no special effects. Um, just extras, just sets, and it looked beautiful as well. And um, directed by Mel Gibson also, um, who I did think looked a little old in the part, but done a really good job despite his crappy Scottish accent. Um, and this is the exclusive box set for it. Here we go. They look nice. Quite a decent size already. I haven't opened it up, so I haven't looked at it. But I like the artwork. There's all the um, the uh, these band, his clan, or his mob, whatever. And him at the front, as usual, talk about easy target. Pick him off right at the start. He's right at the front of the gang. And it's sort of a panoramic goes around. I looked at the other side uh, of the battle of the others. And look, same dude again. Look, another dude wanting to kill himself right at the front. What an idiot. So, there we go. And, um... They may take up lives, but yeah, yeah, okay, all right, yeah, whatever, mate. Um, all right, okay, then, so, a winner of five Oscar Awards. Good, good film. Really, really enjoyed this one. Um, and it all began all because his um, wife-to-be, or was it his wife? I can't remember. I haven't seen this film in, like, ten years. Um, got a uh, throat slit, and he took up revenge, and then he got stronger and stronger, and Scotland become their own country. And De Guin, or whatever, is playing the king, for England. God, don't he make England horrible people? He's really good job in it. Brilliant job. Really nasty guy. You'll remember him from Escape to Alcatraz. So let's open this up. Um, it is magnetic on one end, so it opens up like a book, which is quite nice. And then you got another one of the lines from the movie. Every man dies, not every man really lives. And, uh, well, they do live because they were born. But um, there you go. Uh, and inside we've got the um, the Blu-ray with the slip cover and uh, yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna have to sell this one um, there's no point in having this I've already got the steel book of a Braveheart a nice one is too so uh, saying that they're bringing out another Braveheart steel book aren't they the one that's got the lime on it I prefer the one with the sword myself but anyway yeah I'll swap that round so there's no point in keeping that uh, and then we got lots of bits oh I like lots of bits we got what looks like a I got to say at first a wallet but um, it's not actually it's a badge. Which is great if you're Scottish. If you're not Scottish um, and you're going around with a um, sort of pop pin badge, uh, you look a bit of a twat. But um, yeah, it looks pretty good. I like it. It's got on all of that. Be proud of Scottish. Uh, even though Scottish hate the English for some reason, I don't know why. Um, we still love the Scottish. So there we go. There we are. And oh, look, look, look. It's like a trinket bag. <laughs> Hello, I've got a purse. Although purses these days were little, like little sacks rather than um, like a man's wallet like we get now. Um, they look like, like little bags of gold and um, yeah, it's got the, um, the the symbol that is in the new steel book and uh, I like it actually. Uh, apart from that, that kind of ruins it. Look, that looks really good, doesn't it? Like that little trinket gold bag. It is a gold coin for you. And then on the back it says, Made in China. Oh. <laughs> What a bunch of idiots. Fancy doing that to it. Why? It's not as you're going to go out and buy just that alone, are you? And I was expecting quite a few coins in here. I want to get his bloody one. I'm well, sure um, the bloody... We were meant to have quite a few coins. One coin. Um, so like, what do I have to do? Do I have to order loads more coins to put in it just to make it look better? Braveheart and the symbol. I thought it would have been nice if they'd done sco uh, coins or back in the past. And what they actually were back then, um, rather than just this, this made-up coin. It is nice, I do like it, quite a good quality and 
Boston and all of that, but uh, proper coins for Scotland in the past, and at least three of them would have looked a lot better than that one, but um, yeah, it's all right, uh, apart from that. But um, yeah, okay, what, what else, what other goodies do they pack inside? The original script. This is a big, thick book. I don't think I'm gonna be sitting around reading this for long. Look at it, it's probably over 300 pages in here. Um, but if you're really into the movie, and you find it really interesting, uh, and you want to know the entire script of the movie, I swear this is pretty much what it is, you can read it along while you're watching the movie! You clever people, you! <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's nice, it's alright. It's not something I'll read, but it's something that's nice in a box set collection. It does make a difference having a little collection. And uh, I think we're, we're down to the last piece now. Yeah, I've opened it up. Yeah, but there's nothing else left. There's an envelope. Oh, bonded in blood. Now it's wax from a um, from a, a candle. And this has got the usual what all box sets have: pictures and postcards. They all seem to have them. And uh, we we've got William Wallace. We've got Sophie Marceau playing the Queen of France or something to do with France. Uh, there he is, nasty man, McGowan. Oh, he's such a horrible character in this. And look at him, I've forgotten his name. But um, this is the first film I ever saw him in, and then from then on upwards, obviously without the beard, he's been in hundreds and hundreds of films, big films, a great actor, I love him. He looks so different and young then. Not used to seeing him so young and quite beefed up as well. Um, Catherine McConaughey, who I haven't really seen in virtually any movie 28 weeks later, um, haven't, didn't really do it, did she? I think she's done some British drama TV series. And um, Eric the Bruce, or Robert the Bruce or something, who has, you're familiar with him in Saw 3, and um, it, um, was it Equilibrium, and uh, a few other movies too. Uh, and there you go, you have bled with William, now bleed with me, I didn't know that, they all have different lines. Oh, you're showing off now. Oh look, couldn't crush you like a worm, I thought he was going to have the one where we didn't get dressed up for nothing. The goo and the trouble with Scotland is that it's full of Scots, great line, and his gay son that he's disgusted with as well. Now oh, that one, that one's too long, rule the kingdom. What's William Wallace's one? It's got to be freedom, isn't it? No, not every man, not every man really, oh no, it's that one. Okay, there we go, Braveheart! Freedom! Good box set, not too expensive, 40 quid, not bad. I'm impressed with that, you know I love my box sets and I'll get as many as possible. Enjoyed that, nice one. Here's some steel books I've got as well. Um, v for Vendetta, it's one of the limited ones, it's a beautiful glossy one, I love this movie. I had the Canadian steel book, kind of shit, gold board around it, sucked. But this one, beautiful, glossy, embossings. Then we got V, codename, I'm V, and you're EV. What a great movie, love this movie. Um, little part from the Wachowski brothers, or is it brothers anymore? No, it's not. It's brother stroke sister, even though we all know really he had a dick. Um, beautiful metallic V on the back of it, and uh, if you open it up inside, there, underneath there is um, V himself. Hello, I'm V. Hello, Evie. Right, there he is. And uh, you can buy the mask anywhere now. <laughs> so there we go. Um, v for Vendetta. Awesome movie. Love that movie. Um, I don't normally double dip on steel books and um, generally, you know, buy another one with different artwork and then sell my other one off. But um, this one looks so much better and I hated the first one's artwork so much I had to swap them over. So I uh, sold the other one off and bought this one. Excellent. Kimchi. Are you, are you aware of kimchi? Um, they do what for me is... Very limited, they only do like 4,000 each time or whatever. Um, still books and, and the beautiful and the limited to, no, sorry, about 1,000 or something. And uh, I've already got the the big blue. And this is Leon. I love this movie too. Oh, Gary Oldman, so awesome in this. The way he goes <laughs> with his, his, his oh, and don't interrupt him, he's playing his music. And uh, Leon himself. And, and it's got beautiful words of Leon. I don't know if you can see it in the light. L E O N on there amongst the glossiness and the colour. It looks beautiful, really nice. Um, Matilda on the back. Uh, and it also has the glossy words of Matilda on there too. Um, Natalie Portman, young. Brilliant film. I ain't got enough time to do a video and talk about a review on this because it's been out ages and everyone's seen it, so I'm not gonna go on about it. I've got 204, 500. Shit, they only done 500 of them. Um, and, and there we go, and shit, my battery's about to run out on my camcorder. Quickly, quickly, that's a postcard. That's a postcard, quick, quick, right, there's a booklet with it, and there's a picture on the side, and, and also, quickly, I've got Emily. Um, lenticular, kimchi, again, brilliant, brilliant. I can't believe the battery's about to run out. Card number 723, postcards. Oh, I'm almost getting a joke. 
dogs out, but not quite. Um, beautiful, beautiful movie, absolutely brilliant. This video is about to go dead, and I'm not going to be able to say goodbye until I'm in the new house. Um, but oh shit! I can't believe I'm going to run out of battery. I'm so so. Should change your life forever. Oh, look, 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 cafe, cafe looks good. Kimchi, oh, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. And, and underneath this lenticular poly pit, you have a choice of three. Really good. There she goes. There she is. Uh, 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 hand appears out of nowhere. No, no, it's a horror film. Uh, there, there, there's Amelia going. Lovely, delightful film. Embossed. Great. And um, sorry, guys, I'm gonna have to go because of the back. She's so, so ill prepared for me. Oh man, this sucks. Okay, have a good one. Enjoy the summer. God damn it, it's hot. And um, remember to buy those chocolate coins. Cheers. See you later.